Your Shannon Lober or Mary Edwards make dinner for you. It is always amorous, sometimes glamorous, and definitely full of aphrodisiac-inducing ingredients to entice the palate, the senses, and your sensuality. They also know how to make the perfect French fry. Their new cookery book is called Wise Woman's Cookery, Food, Sex, Magic, and Merriment. It is my pleasure to welcome Shannon Lober and Mary Edwards to Studio 4 to tell us more. Now, how did you two meet? Why, why did you come together? I know you both love food and you get high going to the library and you like history. <laughs> yes. Um, we have been friends for 25 years and we always would sit out in our garden and have these amazing ideas. And being two very romantic girls, we decided that really? we wanted more romance in our life mm -hmm. as we're getting a smidgen older we find we have more of an appetite for romance and we deserve more. So we decided we would start writing about it because when you write about it, you always have these visions of lov loveliness when you go to bed, of these beautiful women and their food and the way they seduce mm -hmm. men. And what a, what a thought to go to bed with in your head. It's wonderful, Fanny. <laughs> it's also the power of the lavender. That's they used delicious. to make lavender spirits more than they do now. Mm -hmm. It's euphoric. Ooh. So it, it makes the wine a little stronger tasting. But it, after you've drank it with mm. a dinner party, it makes That's everyone amazing. laugh. Well, and who would know that it, you put lavender in nice wine and it tastes good? Oh. You know, it tastes fabulous. I like that. Yes. But the thing is, is eating to wake you up, not to put you to mm. sleep, which right. is why we use you know, real food, simple recipes. Uh, because a lot of times when you eat uh, food in fast food restaurants and, and greasy food, you just want to go to sleep. Right. And that's what we're trying to stay to, away from. To uh, awaken us and, and yes. imbue us with uh, erotic thoughts and, uh, and also relationships. Bring them to the fore. Bring them into balance.